So my first awakening, I was uh, in the Santa Cruz Mountains on a silent retreat by myself. And one afternoon I took a hike and when I walked up to the top of the mountain, I turned around and in that moment that I turned around, suddenly I, it was like I smelled everything in the universe, all the little things of the universe and I could taste everything and see everything and feel everything. It was this amazing sensory experience and it was so such an amazing experience of oneness but at the same time I was hearing the voices of my teachers Sri Mahayogi and Ajashanti saying to me that's just a spiritual experience keep going get deeper and so I walked down the hill with this intention of just finding out what else was there and when I got to the bottom suddenly I just saw it suddenly I just saw this infinite and this presence and this awareness that had always been there. And for me, honestly, my reaction was, oh my God, duh, because this had been here the whole time. And I remembered that I had noticed it, but hadn't known what it was. And it made me realize that when I was 17, I'd had an awakening, but I had no clue what it was because I was raised Christian and had never heard of an awakening when I was 17. And I had associated God with something, I don't know, I guess more luminous or mythological or something, not the infinite, not emptiness, not any of these things. And so after that experience in the Santa Cruz Mountains, what I found was that I kept having deeper and deeper awakenings, like a, a series of awakenings, um, that did start to change my life in different ways. And then my final awakening, you know, honestly, I don't even remember what it was. I don't remember the moment so clearly, but what I do remember was a couple days later, realizing that there was no question anymore about the oneness. There was no question that I was separate. I'm not separate. And there was no question that all is the infinite. And that's sustained.